Uh, okay, here, here's a bit of soil chemistry. So I'm holding this uh, piece of mud that I just took off from the surface of the soil. And it's interesting because you see a brownish layer on top here, a thin one. Uh, it is about maybe extends about two, three millimeters deep into the soil. On top of that is actually a bit more greenish. Yeah. And then underneath of that we have this dark gray blackish soil. Yeah. And that's basically what's happen, uh, happening in a flooded soil. It's what we call a chemical reaction which is actually driven by microbial processes reducing the, the, the iron compounds from iron, two, iron 3 uh, oxides and hydroxides which have a reddish color into iron 2 compounds which have a grayish uh, color. You know, so what we have up here is basically a layer where the oxygen still comes in from the water that we put on and though that always stays oxidized and underneath of that we have this uh, highly anaerobic reduced uh, soil in which the roots are but this is also up here a very biologically active layer which is why it's greenish on top so you've got algae living on top doing nitrogen fixation and all kind of things